Hello the Taurus, welcome back to the channel and welcome to your reading for the month of April. We're going to jump straight into it and uh, clarify a couple of uh, bits and pieces for you and uh, we're going to find out exactly what's happening and what's going to happen in the month of April for yourself. Um, I hope you enjoy your day, thank you very much for joining me um, and uh, thank you very much for your energy and your time. Um, we're going to have three different kind of rows, yes please, uh, we're going to have three different kind of rows, we're going to have a uh, row for the uh, energy and uh, basically energy around April and uh, what April will bring you. Uh, second thing, uh, second line, we're going to have um, how can you get the most out of the month of April and uh, also uh, we will have a third row, uh, something to be mindful of in the month of April. At the end we're going to clarify with a free yes or no cards at the end. Um, at the below in the description of this video you have uh, the time stamp and you can take yourself straight into the um, into that uh, uh, into those three cards at the end. Um, I'm going to give you a bit of a time as well so you can uh, exactly, uh, so you can pose and you can just uh, um, think about the question. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to answer it yes or no, um, just like if I w know the question, okay? Um, but, uh, but yeah, we'll just see what's in store for yourself. And let's see what's happening to Taurus. What's happening to Taurus? Uh, Spirit, can I have please uh, three more cards for Taurus, please? Three more cards for Taurus. Thank you very much. Um, Spirit. I just need two more cards, guys. Just two more cards and then I am happy. No. Right. That wasn't intended. Uh, but um, I think someone's playing a bit of a game with me, so... <laughs> as you do, as you do. Um, Spirit, please, can I have uh, two more cards? Thank you very much for your help, Spirit. Thank you very much for coming forward as well. I'm going to take this one. And I'm going to take this one. I just need one more, Spirit. Thank you very much. Oh, no way. <laughs> Look at that. There's actually a hidden card underneath this one. <laughs> I'm going to take it there. Okay, and uh, let's just do a bit of a more of a clarification with the spirit cards and spirit time to collab collaborate. Okay, uh, we've got second one, a koala spirit. Spirit has a plan. Okay, and the third one is turtle spirit. Slow and steady wins the race. Okay. Uh, but uh, but yeah, let's just start with uh, from the beginning energy with uh, uh, for the new month of April and what to expect. Um, I can see that you're going to be working with quite a lot of uh, different people. It's like you're part of some kind of team, and uh, I can see that you're working quite hard in order to get to the point of uh, your uh, dreams okay so the second card in here is the uh, number six dream card okay and it's actually very very significant because it's um, it's rev in reverse so I would say that uh, you're working on some kind of goal and um, and uh, some kind of dream and it's not exactly coming uh, coming to you yet. Uh, I think there will be a bit of a time uh, which you need um, like a time scale or time uh, needs to elapse in order for you to achieve that goal um, and achieve that dream, okay? But it is coming, okay? So the cards want me to tell you that uh, the dream is actually coming and uh, whatever you've envisioned, it is there, okay? Um, in terms of the, there is uh, some kind of weird uh, energy around politics at work and uh, around uh, certain people. I think just certain people are not uh, exactly 
um, trustworthy okay so just try not to maybe uh, give them too much ammunition so that's what, uh, what I get from the cards uh, they are basically you have to have a bit of a mask at work okay you can't be yourself entirely Taurus um, but uh, but uh, yeah it's just something what uh, is in store at the moment okay um, I can see that there is, uh, your, your work is kind of stressful and uh, you've got uh, this uh, um, not maybe negative negative vibe but it's not not exactly positive neither okay so I think um, let me just do a bit, uh, do a bit of a clarification uh, you've got uh, Queen of Earth um, find the time for uh, people around you um, and um, be uh, be proactive um, and um, be gentle and uh, very mindful of uh, uh, certain things which are happening in your life at the moment okay it's actually a very significant card you know and like um, I know that uh, you know uh, Tauruses usually are very grounded people and uh, you exactly uh, you want to uh, keep it real okay but um, I think you you are so occupied with work that you don't have that much time uh, at home maybe or in your private life and it can't I want me to just to tell you that uh, you don't live only for work purposes okay so if you've got this uh, possibility and this uh, um, this uh, um, you've got time to spend uh, at home it's very very advisable for you and especially in the month of April okay so that's what I get in here we're gonna do a bit of a more clarification a bit later on but that's what I get at the moment from from your energy um, for the month of uh, April I think it will be very extremely busy in terms of the work uh, uh, but at the same time don't forget about your family and your your uh, uh, your home okay and where that's where you are needed as well okay so it's 50 50 uh, what, what you need to and um, uh, what you need in terms of the time in the month of April okay uh, in terms of uh, uh, how uh, you can get the most out of the month of uh, of um, uh, of um, April you've got the uh, koala spirit spirit has a plan um, and, and pretty much that, that's it I think uh, um, I think you need to believe in yourself because I've got the belief uh, card in here in reverse like uh, I think uh, like certain aspects of what you're doing at the moment maybe you're you're doing them but you're not e exactly there with your mind like you're not maybe um, I think you need just need to basically um, slow down a bit and uh, just uh, quiet your mind okay so that's what I get in here I can see that you're working with loads of different people and uh, some of them people are very negative some of them people are okay to, towards you um, but um, but yeah I think in general uh, in, in general um, if you want to get the most out of the month of April um, I would uh, I would uh, go back to basics and calm down a bit uh, try not to rush into any decisions um, and um, um, just try to uh, quiet your mind as much as you can okay um, and then you we can I mean like you can do it for the different kind of things you know like uh, working out or meditation Reiki um, or just running outside or just uh, anything which, which makes you happy but you basically need to calm your, your mind down uh, down okay well, let me just do a bit of a clarification you got the Queen of Fire um, spread your wings and fly um, start to uh, be positive towards yourself uh, and uh, protect your uh, dreams and, and your independence okay and it's a, actually a very very significant card it's and it's pretty much sums up the, the those two rows um, I, I mean like I can see that you've got something planned for the future or you're thinking about uh, the future and uh, um, uh, and doing something else something extra something completely out of the outside of the box um, and it will be very beneficial for you but uh, you will have to undertake some kind of courses or some kind of um, extra uh, planning will be needed in order for you to achieve that goal okay and um, so I, I I would uh, say that uh, it's something towards the so you're gonna go towards the changing your workplace or your or your team etc and uh, you're gonna go towards something completely different 
Um, in terms of uh, creativity and independence, I think it, we can refer it to the to the new work as well. I think it will be better if you will start working for yourself or you're thinking about your work, working for yourself and uh, you want to just make that transition uh, and go uh, to, in order to go um, towards uh, your self uh, efficiency okay and uh, and it's uh, all well and good but uh, remember that uh, to not jump into it too quickly okay so that's what I get in here just uh, do it in stages okay so I can see you doing things one by one okay Taurus um, and uh, yeah start believing in yourself because uh, as I as I, oh, I said to you in one of those cards, like you you seem very stressed and you seem very um, very on the edge. Okay, so you need to calm your mind down as much as you can, um, and um, and yeah, just believe in yourself and in your power, uh, and uh, that you can actually achieve that goal. Okay. Now, something to be mindful of in the month of uh, April, you've got Turtle Spirit, slow and steady wins the race. And exactly, that's what we actually talk about in those first two rows. Um, slow down a bit, okay, look at the bigger picture uh, of what you want to uh, achieve. There is a card of uh, change. Okay, and there is a card of uh, of blooming and uh, and uh, new beginnings. Okay, so yes, the change is coming to you, and it's written inside of your sort of inside of your cells, as, as to speak. Um, but um, I see. I've got in here. Uh, uh, you. I've got in here. Um, staying in the past card in reverse. Okay, so. Uh, there is some kind of uh, there is some kind of uh, blockage in terms of uh, you. Um, if you're gonna move, then move, okay, and uh, and don't dwell on what have happened in the past, okay. Uh, as simple as, okay. It might be connected to actually to your relationship as well. Um, that um, if uh, if you're thinking about changing uh, the person who you uh, spend time with. Uh, then just do it and uh, just don't play silly games because uh, I can see in here that the person doesn't like it at all okay um, but uh, but yes uh, let, let me just do a bit of more clarification for you Taurus you've got uh, one Ness card Archangel Sandalphone um, and you've got the nine of earth okay Yes, yeah, so I've got. I can see in here some kind of spiritual awakening or spiritual kind of journey uh, taking place in your life. Um, um, you looking for some kind of mentors or masters who could teach you a bit different ways, um, um, or even you know even some of the friends who you meet who you meet. I think you're you're going to be seeking their advice in regards to what's exactly happening to you, um, and uh, what. Just remember that if you ask someone for advice, it's their point of view, it's not your point of view, okay? So you can take certain things on board, but don't take it uh, uh, um, just uh, in 100%, in, um, okay? And yeah, just be happy with uh, small things, okay? Because small things make amazing and uh, a lot of difference in your life. Um, uh, just spend some time in the lo uh, being uh, being alone, but being alone, I think, sort of to speak, spend time with yourself in your inner self and your own mind, uh, as well as spend time with your family. Um, again, just don't uh, don't uh, rush, and uh, uh, just calm yourself down. And it actually says at the bottom of the card, uh, it's very beneficial for you to work for. For your own self okay so that's what the card says in here at the bottom and pretty much that's what we had talked about uh, in this reading okay it's uh, if you're thinking about change and working for yourself do it okay but yeah let me just uh, jump uh, straight into yes or no cards so we've got three cards uh, think about the question um, and uh, please pause the video if you want um, and um, and then yeah let me just pick up the first card uh, Ace of Swords uh, 
Yes, but uh, there will be certain obstacles on your way uh, which may, might influence your decision, okay? But I would say yes, do it, because it, you will grow and you will learn from it, okay? Uh, question number two. Uh, you've got a uh, knight of swords in reverse. I would say no. Uh, I would say no because it will be just not beneficial um, and uh, it will bring you a bit of chaos in your life. Okay, so don't do it. Uh, question number three is ace of cups in reverse i would say yes but uh, you will have to seek some kind of advice from someone in order to achieve that okay so yeah uh, taurus so that's your reading for the month of april i hope you've enjoyed it if you did press thumbs up um, and uh, check my other uh, playlists for the month uh, somewhere in here or in here i never know exactly where they are but yeah check my other videos uh, and thank you for watching bye